Okay, welcome to Northern Ants. I am actually out at the Big Brook Creek today outside Cable, Wisconsin. So I'm going to see if I can't get myself some trout. Hope you enjoy the video, and I will talk to you in the comments. Okay, let's give this a go. I usually don't fish here. Let's we're gonna try off a the culvert first. And then we'll go downstream. They're probably gonna be in the shadow areas because it's uh, pretty sunny right now. We've had had clouds have been kind of coming and going. I guess we're going to start walking downstream. I'll be back with you as soon as I get to the next spot. Well, I went up, I tried going this way and I stepped and that was a suction mud up to my knee. So we're walk we're going the other way. Might not be as good, but well it might be good, but I was hoping to try this way, but luckily I only put one foot in. Do one foot at a time. Cause uh I would have been stuck. <laughs> the ground is a lot nicer. It's uh, more gravel. I've got my leader on my belt and it's kind of driving me crazy. <laughs> the vibrant and the jingling. So I'm gonna put it in the pouch. Mosquitoes are not pleasant this year. Oh, wait a minute. Got a stick. <laughs> and a tree. Oh, and a trout. There's a trout on the line that's oh, dangling in the water over the branch. And it was, it was a trout on it. It was a little one, but. Oh yeah, there we go. Not too bad. Not a bad size. Yeah. I'm only gonna keep them if they're real big though. I want it to be a good meal out of one fish. Picked up a piece of leaf, it looks like, and that will do it. Oh. Very nice walking through here. This is a it's like a sand bottom right now. Oh. Yeah, 
that stick. <laughs> Like the water is so shallow I can see the bottom. It's weird that I couldn't see that trout, <laughs> how they blend in with the weeds. Uh-oh, sticks. Oh, good. Didn't stick. Got a little bit of a corner coming here. Let's see if there's anything hiding up in this corner. Let's fix our night crawler. It's getting a little beat up here. I was going over my channel stats. Oh, there we got one. Another little guy. I was going over my stats the other day and I got 90% or that watch my videos, oh, yeah, little guy, uh, are not subscribed. So if you could, if you're watching the video, please just, you know, hit that subscribe button. I really appreciate it. it. Helps the channel. Helps drive the videos. Hopefully, it'll you know show the videos to more people that might enjoy watching them, and it helps the channel so I can grow it. Yeah, so far one little one in that corner that was about it might have been the one I had on but down on downstream a little, a little farther oh had something hitting it oh <laughs> I thought it was a thought I had something on there. I'm trying to get my get my net here. That way we don't see it's a little bit bigger. Yeah. Not too bad. I think I'm gonna keep this one because he's had it swallowed pretty good. We'll throw him on the stringer. Not too much bigger than the than the first one, but better than just letting him die and float. Yeah, see right through here it's it looks pretty shallow. But there's a definitely something in there. <laughs> Sometimes a big splash like that helps, it kinda of draws draws them in thinking something fell from the sky and landed.
got a tree. So there's somebody up on the road. Yeah, I was probably hiding behind this. If you can see that in the video, it's like a branch across here. I'm trying to get my. There it is. Watch that fish if it looks like it's gonna make it. I'll probably just let it go. It is seems to be doing pretty good. I think I'm gonna let it go because I kind of want a bigger one. If I'm gonna, there we go. Yeah, he he took off right away. So. A little shallower water here because it's got a little bit of a ripple in it. I had just turned the camera off. At least I think I turned it off. I was going to save a little battery life until I got to the next spot. And I had a deer walk in front. Hopefully I caught some of it up. So we will see. I just wanted to throw some fresh crawl around my my line okay got some fresh worm on there deer walking in front here maybe we'll come up on them better a deer than a cougar or a bear Okay, well, I'll be back with you as soon as we get closer to a new spot. Okay, we're coming up on some, like a little corner right here. With some overhang. See, there's like a little bit of like a rapid right here. Some of this part, like over here, kind of doesn't look like it would be anything here, but we're gonna try it anyways. Oh, or catch a stick. Okay, let's get it to the other shoreline. As far away from us as we can. Uh-oh, 
I was afraid of that. There's a fallen tree there. I'm trying to throw it close to it. Threw it too close to it. Oh! Ooh! Hey, the fish took it off the off the snag. something in there. Yep, took a piece of it. Took that new stuff I just put on there. Yeah, there's definitely something right in here. He's picking away at my bait. Tighten it up on here some. Yeah, it did a number on my bait. Oh, it's not taking it off of that. Shoot. Well, I guess that fish is going to have to meet me farther upstream. Because... I'll be back with you. Okay, we got like a deep, deep pocket right here. Looked like something was moving. <gasps> no. <laughs> there, yeah. Yeah, there's something there. Oh, they're little ones. Bunch of tiny ones. I could just see them. Pretty deep little pocket right here. I can see them in there. Yeah, they're all pretty tiny. So I don't know if I really want to. We'll throw us it in there once and see what if we can get anything to follow. Yeah, that's all. Let's see if we can't get up around this deep spot. without sinking in. Yeah, it's a pretty big pocket, but that was all pretty small. Something just jumped up ahead of me there. Right around in there. Oh, 
Oh no. <laughs> about where it jumped. Yep, there it is. Little bitty guy again. Yeah. Almost had him. Little tiny guy, though. Might actually be a chub. Beautiful back in here. No clouds, but just enough to break up the sun once in a while. A lot of dragonflies flying around overhead. That's good. They're keeping keeping the mosquitoes away. Or down at least, because I'm not getting attacked too much. There's a light breeze too. It's helping. Some footprints in the in the on the ground. So somebody was walking here not too long ago.
There we got one. And a little guy. Very little. It's like the size of a minnow I like to use for walleye. Okay, let's try that corner again. You know, it's like an S right through here. Sun went under and the mosquitoes came out even heavier. Oh, it kind of goes two directions here. Yeah, it seems to be going, and it, there's coming off here too. Where those two combine, it might be a good spot. Oh, it's like a, a lip because this kind of ate away. Water kind of rerouted. Looks like. Okay, I'm going to get rebaited and we'll. Sorry about my arm in front of the camera once in a while. The mosquitoes are all over my arms. I need to reach over and smash them. Well, 
I think we head back. Okay, well, that's the end of the video. Thank you so much for watching. Remember to smash that like button and subscribe if you haven't done so. Thank you so much. Have a great rest of your day. Well, thank you so much for stopping by and watching one of my videos. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and the bell icon so you know exactly when the next video comes out. I do offer a wide range of different kinds of videos, so check out the playlist and you might find something else that you like other than this kind of video you watched today. Thank you so much. Comment down below what you thought or just say hi. Have a great rest of your day.